Hi, I'm Wade from Thoroughbred Diesel. Today we're going to be showing you the ATS Doomsday device. So ATS has come out with what they call the Doomsday device. Now, this is marketed for the Dodge Cummins 68 RFE owners, and the year will be 2007 and a half to current. But truth be told, this will really work on any uh, automatic, automatic transmission dipstick. So why was this developed? So the 2019 to 2020 Dodge three-quarter ton and ton trucks with the 68 RFE had a, had a national safety recall um, done on them. Uh, that is NHTSA uh, recall number 20V-043. Um, if you do some research on that, you can read about it uh, quite a bit. If you own one of these trucks and you have not gotten the recall information, um, um, listen to what we've got to say here. So again, 2019 trucks with 2020 three-quarter ton and ton trucks with 68 RFE, approximately about 85,000 uh, vehicles in that. What was happening with these trucks is you were having a buildup of pressure in the transmission, pressure and heat, and that was expelling transmission fluid out of the dipstick, uh, out of the transmission dipstick. And where the transmission fluid was coming out, it's in, uh, it's in close proximi proximity to your exhaust manifold and turbocharger. Uh, where the engine produces heat, so it is a fire hazard. There were some of these trucks that actually burnt down because of this failure. So um, Dodge came up with a fix for that um, inside of this inside of this recall bulletin. Actually tells you what's done to the truck. There is a uh, new lower valve body that will be uh, changed out onto the trucks. Uh, there are two orifices on this lower valve body. Uh, it's going to increase the orifice size on one of the holes on the valve body. I know you probably can't see that here. Again, the recall talks about it, um, and that's supposed to alleviate this. There's also some PCM programming that will come along with that, and we'll get you taken care of. But um, ATS saw this recall and came up with a device that is going to keep the hot transmission fluid from being able to push out the dipstick tube, pass the dipstick, fall on the exhaust manifold, and possibly cause a fire. So again, it's called the Doomsday Device. How this works, there's set screws around the base of this device. Now these set screws are going to go and they're going to lock down onto your transmission dipstick tube. It's going to hold that in place right there. Then the device also has a lock for the dipstick itself. So then you'll You'll put the dipstick back in, it'll lock down with this clip right here to where it cannot be pushed out. So now if you have this failure, what's going to happen here is this is going to force the transmission fluid up. It's going to stop at the dipstick where it cannot escape from, and it's going to be rerouted through the hose and safely away from the exhaust manifold uh, out into a spot of your choosing. So you don't have to worry about it going to, uh, again, another ignition place that can catch it on fire and burn your whole truck down. Uh, you know. This would be good for guys that already have scheduled to have their recall done and it's a couple of weeks out. If you want to get one of these just for safety's sake, uh, we suggest probably that you don't drive the truck, but uh, if you want to get one of these for safety's sake, but it's also good just to uh, place one of these on the trucks. I mean, what's it going to hurt? You know, if you have this problem, if you have this failure, this is going to keep you out of a uh, possibly uh, doomsday situation. So. The ATS Doomsday device, we are going to actually link you inside of this video and on the selling page for this product to the TSB or the safety recall um, for the trucks so you can get information on you on for that because that's, that's the most important part. Uh, we're also going to link you to a page where you can uh, purchase this Doomsday device uh, for your vehicle. And we are going to do a small installation video showing it to you on a truck and what it's going to look like. So. Uh, if you have any questions on the ATS Doom to Doomsday device or this recall or anything else, we'll be glad to help you. Just give us a call and thank you for watching.